Hello and good morning beautiful Jammy Gems. I've been getting so many downloads about these changes since this portal has opened. The readings are completely changing. So it's all new information coming in but I have been getting a lot of downloads about past life stuff coming into play. So I want to use the past life deck to see how this is affecting Gemini. So our, this is like the year of karma and all these changes and I want to see what is changing for Gemini's. So Gemini, thank you so very much for all your likes, your comments, your subscriptions and welcome all you new subscribers here. Gemini energy. Gemini. One more spirit saying, Gemini, Gemini, this one, phobias, hmm. a baby in reverse, Gemini, a karmic relationship, the arts, and orphan. Some of your heritages go way back to biblical days. There's some type of phobias here or fears. In a past life, there could have been a loss of a baby due to a karmic relationship. There could have been a karmic child that was given up for adoption somehow. It's something to do with the arts here. And the arts is like musicians. This is a guitar on here, piano, whatever. You're very gifted with the arts here. Somebody in a past life was orphaned due to a karmic relationship. The baby is in reverse. A fears are here. Gemini. Someone may have fears of being orphaned. And maybe this karmic relationship that was from a past life has been carried over to this life. It is something to do with the baby. Either the, maybe the karmic said that they were having a baby or maybe they lost a baby. Maybe they gave a, someone got orphaned here, had to give up a child because it was a karmic relationship. Time for a nap. That's the fear. There's a karmic energy here. Fearing that they're going to lose this person. They want peace. Someone is imagining their loyal heart, their soulmate. Hmm. Someone, this karmic was imagining that this was their soulmate, but it's not their soulmate. And the feminine got orphaned for the karmic. And maybe the karmic said that they were having a child, but no. Go by the book. Go the distance. There is an unfinished symphony between the feminine 
and the masculine. This person is doing a lot of thinking. A higher power is involved here. Mm -hmm. Exchanging gifts. What's going on here? Yeah, the karmic is knowing that this person wants to come back to their soulmate. There's unfinished business here. The karmic is in fear. It's the same damn karmic from last life, yeah. It's the masculine who wants the feminine. Tell the truth, go the distance, that's what's going on. This karmic um, used a child, but the child is in reverse. So maybe there was no child. Or the karmic is saying that they had a baby, but it's not their baby. This karmic from past life has come to this life. This masculine has knowledge that this is their about a family. It's going through a purification. See, this karmic is trying to be flexible, being very playful. Because they have knowledge that this masculine wants to come in and purify this relationship. Mm -hmm. Karmic knows that this is going to be prosperity. The bee spirit. Generosity, patience, That's what caused this uncertainty. I think that this karmic energy, this masculine is going to end up letting go or the karmic is going to let go of this masculine energy. It was like payback, I'm hearing. Having to accept it. Yep, tower. It's some kind of past life karmic debt that the masculine acquired in a past life. Maybe the masculine, this karmic, was trying to hold on to this masculine using a baby, but the baby is in reverse. So maybe the karmic lied about a child in a past life and now has come back to this life doing the same thing to this masculine. The masculine is figuring it out. Yeah, getting enlightenment. Gemini. Baby mama energy. Change. It's the it's karmic. Karmic contract. Gemini. That's why this person was at a crossroads. There is justice, truth will be told. This 
somebody walked away or I think this karmic may be walking away or the masculine or maybe you did the merchant was giving to two and this masculine refused to see what the universe had offered them somebody walked away King of Cups, getting judged, judgment, karmic judgment. They're being judged. Spiritual judgment. Hmm. Needing to take leadership here. I don't know. Yeah, this family situation. Now, what's going on? Hmm. They're getting enlightenment. They're going within. They were a player. I don't know, that's baby daddy, but this is the King of Wands looking at the King of Cups. Now, I don't know if the King of Wands is the father of this baby or the King of Wands is looking at the father of this baby. Somebody is getting ghosted, and I think the karmic is ghosting them. Well, it's fair because they ghosted their soul mate. Hmm. Magician, yeah. It's the karmic. It is the karmic. So, we have a king and a queen of wands here, which are a perfect match. There are secrets. It was an illusion. And now there's going to be a tower between the karmic and this. masculine there could be two masculines i'm not sure yet something sh that's going to end in a tower and whoever this masculine is is going to get ghosted by the karmic and maybe the karmic has like a baby daddy energy that they're that they are going to or the this person is the daddy what about this news? Good news. Oh, somebody's blocking the third party. Or the third party is blocking this masculine. You reap what you sow. Hmm. The Emperor. They were put, they're going to be put in a competition. Things are going to end, and this Emperor is supposed to get enlightenment. So it's like the Karmic is actually doing vengeance on the Emperor for what they did in a past life. Maybe this Emperor was with their feminine energy and 
took on this karmic and maybe this karmic was trying to get vengeance on this emperor in this lifetime it's looking like they are something about this child yeah it is It is about this child. And this emperor is looking at, is this my seed? Something about working while they were working. This child may have died or something like that in a past life. Or told this masculine that the child died. But I don't think that this child was this emperor's. You know what I mean? There is grieving. Yes. Because they lost their empress. Due to the, they ended things with the empress. To go to this karmic who said that they were pregnant, obviously. And then may have told the, the masculine that the child had passed away. Or that it was stillborn or that they lost the child. It was a trick to hurt the emperor. Yep. Yep, it was a lie, cheating, maybe theft, money, something to do with that. It was vengeance, some kind of vengeance, some kind of karma got to play out there. Yeah. Yeah. A betrayal. They end up being betrayed and hurt by the karmic. It's payback. The karmic wanted payback on this emperor. Poverty. truth is going to be told, spoken. What's this? Mm -hmm. They're gaining knowledge. Yeah, they're angry for being a fool, for taking this. Yeah, they're get, it's something playing out. Karma from a past life. Past life karmic debt. Yes, it is. And now this person wants to come back around to their empress and start anew. They had a karmic debt to pay of some type. There's the apology card. Making a move toward, yeah, they should have fought for this um, connection. This is, they should have fought for the Empress and defended the Empress. Who is now single? <laughs> Le learning a lesson. Karmic lesson. 
Yep. And now they want to offer commitment and marriage to this empress. They're guided to do so. Yes, it is. To reunite. Yep. Yep. But that jealousy and envy kept the, this got them trapped here. <coughs> Juggling made them unsure. It is baby mama energy. It was a karmic contract to get their money. They knew that this was their true love. But this karmic confused them. But it ends up ending. And then they want a new beginning. A victory. Divinely guided. Faded. High priestess energy. Deep knowing. Spiritual connection. And they are heavily burdened. Because they got to get. They're going through spiritual judgment. So they had to complete this cycle. Because somehow they owed a karmic debt. To whoever this karmic is. Maybe they uh, never got their karma in a past life for what they're doing and it's playing out in this life. I don't know. I just know that they are guided to come toward their divine partner or their person they were supposed to be with in this lifetime and this karmic trapped them because wanted some kind of vengeance on this emperor. Maybe for putting him in a bad position. I don't know. The loss of a child. I just know that in this lifetime... These things are going to play out. I wouldn't be surprised if they're playing out soon. Because the energies are changing drastically from day to day. It was due to a karmic relationship. The baby is in reverse. And it has caused this karmic to have fears. You know what I mean? Phobias about the loss of a child because it was a karmic relationship and maybe this baby was set out for orphanage to keep it quiet so in this lifetime it may replay again i don't know if the karmic lied about a child and it was given up for orphan i don't know But there was a karmic debt owing. I do know that. And that's why the karmic is here. To seek vengeance on this emperor. They are reaping what they have sown. Take care.